The University of Manitoba Archives and Special Collections is home to a wide assortment of historical and cultural research materials, including rare books, like this one on display. All of the items in the archives are located in closed, climate-controlled storage areas, so you have to ask an archivist to retrieve documents for you. Rare books and documents must be handled carefully with special equipment because they are often very old and can be fragile. They must be rested on a soft foam cradle and handled with cotton gloves to protect the pages from harmful oils found on hands. A weighted bookmark, known as a snake, will also be provided to keep the book open. It is important to remember when working with rare books to turn the pages slowly and carefully. Access to rare books at the University of Manitoba provides a unique opportunity to conduct research on primary materials. This diploma, for example, is unusual because it is in the form of a book, unlike today's diplomas. The cover appears to be made of leather with gold stamping, and the front page of the diploma is elaborately decorated with numerous pictures of various subjects. The rest of the diploma is similarly decorated and includes handwritten text. On the second last page is a date, 31 January 1684. There are many questions to ask regarding this particular text. Who is the graduate of this diploma? What is his name? What does the diploma say? What is it for? Why is the diploma adorned with so many images? What is their significance? Who are the people in the images? What do they represent? Who painted these pictures and made this diploma? As there are over 30,000 items in the rare book and manuscript collection, the archivist will not have all the answers for you. They can, however, assist you in developing strategies to conduct your own research. Ask yourself, what elements of the document are most interesting to you? Can these elements be classified into categories? Will these categories help direct you to useful information? By organizing your points of interest in such a way, the archivist will be able to assist you in your research more effectively. For the answers to the mysteries of the Padua Diploma, visit the Rare Books section of the University of Manitoba Archives and Special Collections website.